We all love trying out new software. But how do you get rid of it in case it disappoints? Keep watching to learn how you can remove software down to the last byte and put programs to sleep to free up resources with a shampoo Uninstaller 12. Enjoy! Uninstaller not only removes program installations without leftovers, but also apps and browser plugins. You can get a good look at the currently installed applications, apps and plugins on the overview page. Clicking a tile takes you to the underlying category. You can always return to the overview by clicking the navigation item. The bottom tiles list the most recently installed applications and also allow for their instant removal. Tiles with yellow corners indicate installations logged by Uninstaller. You can use the button on the overview page to toggle installation monitoring. If enabled, future installations will be logged automatically, including all system modifications. This ensures they are completely removable without leftovers. There's also a dedicated tile for logged installations on the overview page. Here's how to get rid of an installed application. If the application is not listed at the bottom on the overview page, Click Applications on the left. The table lists all installed applications along with details like installation date, file size and whether the installation was logged by Uninstaller. It also includes customer supplied ratings to help you quickly spot unnecessary programs. For additional details like program version and file location, click the Info icon next to the affected application. You can also use the subcategories on the left to filter through the list of programs. In this example, I'll use the search to locate XNView. Once found, I check the entry. You can repeat this process to select additional programs if needed. The number of selected programs, along with the total reclaimable disk space, is displayed to the left of the Uninstall button. Once I click Uninstall, the removal process is initiated. We've pre-selected in-depth cleaning for you. Click Settings to further customize the Uninstall procedure. I want to hide the original Uninstall routine, so I select that setting and click OK to confirm. Finally. I click Uninstall to start removing the application. Once removed, I see a summary including the number of deleted objects and the amount of disk space reclaimed. I then click Close to conclude the process. Removing Windows apps or browser plugins is done in the same way, as I will now demonstrate for Microsoft Edge. Next, let's check out the new hibernation mode. It allows you to put infrequently used applications to sleep to free up resources for your other programs. The first time you open the hibernation page, you'll see a bunch of noteworthy hints. The module then lists all installed applications that meet specific system load criteria sorted by system impact. Programs that do not meet set criteria are excluded. Clicking Hibernate gives you another hint that it would be best to quit the affected program first and has you confirm your action before putting the program and its associated processes to sleep. The program is now no longer consuming system resources, except disk space, but remains instantly available should I need it again. It certainly is a great alternative to uninstalling it. Hibernating programs are marked accordingly. Click Wake Up to re-enable the affected program and processes. In most cases, you can also launch the program the usual way to have it wake up automatically. 
make sure to also check out the Tools section that includes various features to clean your PC. That's it for today. A Shampoo Uninstaller 12 is your perfect weapon against no longer needed software. It not only removes applications down to the last byte, but also performs extensive cleaning thanks to built-in features like Drive Cleaner, Registry Optimizer, Internet Cleaner and others. It's a valuable addition to our cleaning and optimization powerhouse that is a Shampoo Win Optimizer. If you like this video, make sure to give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for automatic updates about new content. Until then, enjoy the program and see you next time.